Hello, I am Flash Isaac. This is Flash Ninas. You are now watching 120 Days to Jam. This is a series containing 120 videos to prepare you for jam. Each episode of the series contains introduction, outline, detailed class, questions, and homework for you. The questions and homework are from the Flash Learners Jam application. Install Flash Learners Jam app today to access all the free features. Click activate and scroll to buy activation key to get access to the golden features. Don't be scared, the app is affordable. Do you have trust issues? Simply chat me directly on Facebook, WhatsApp, Instagram, and Telegram for installation and activation instruction. Ladies and gentlemen, it is time to take off. This is the episode 8 of 120 Days to Jump Mathematics with Flash Isaac. We know that simple interest is principal times rate times time over 100. With this knowledge and the knowledge of the previous class, if I read this question to you, find the principal which amounts to 5,500 Naira as simple interest in 5 years at 2% per annum. You will be tempted to take 5,500 Naira as the interest, then 5 years as the time which is correct, then rate 2% which is correct. And you simply make principal subject formula and solve for principal. Most times, your answer will be in the option. Sometimes, your answer will not be in the option. That will leave you confused. You will feel you are not adding or multiplying properly. Ladies and gentlemen, whenever you see a mouth in question, that looks like simple interest question. Think twice. That is involving compound interest. Anytime you see or hear amount in a question that looks like simple interest question, you need to change your mindset. Don't just substitute or hurry. You simply tell yourself amount. What is Amount. Amount is equals principal plus interest. That is it. With this knowledge, you'll be able to solve any question that involves amount. This is find the principal which amounts to 5,500 Naira. So amounts to the 5,500 Naira it's not interest, it's not principal, it is simply amount, amount, amount. What else should you know? If amount is principal plus interest, amount is simply principal plus interest is principal times rate times time over 100. So call this equation 1, call this equation 2. If you are given the simple interest and the principal, your amount is to add them. Now, if you are given amount and you are given rate and time to look for principal, like we are asked to do, this is what we simply do. Amount is principal plus principal times rate times time over 100, where everything here represents the interest. So, from this question, amount is 5,500 Naira, uh, time is equals 5, rate is equals 2. Substituting into this formula, amount 5,500 is equals principal, is what you are looking for. Principal plus principal again, times rate is 2, times time is 5 over 100. This is 5,500 is equals P plus 10P over 
hundred. We can use this ten to cancel ten. Since ten divided by ten is one, hundred divided by ten is ten. This would be five five zero zero is equals p plus p over ten. On the other hand, you may choose to look for LCM from here and solve directly. One thing about mathematics is that don't let one person's way of solving change your own way of solving. If you already know how to go about here and get your value of P, do it so long we arrive at the correct answer. You don't need to say because I cancel the F, you must cancel. So long you do the right thing, you get the correct answer. From here, I will choose to look for LCM. Since P is the same thing as P over 1, and they are separated by plus. 5,500 is equals the LCM of 1 and 10 is 10. 10 divided by 1 is 10. 10 times P is 10P. Plus 10 divided by 10 is 1. 1 times P is 1P. 10P plus 1P, that is 11P. So 5,500 is equals 11P over 10. And when you cross multiply, this is something as 5,500 over 1. Cross multiplying, you have 5,500 times 10 is equals 11P. Using 10 to multiply is simply adding 1, 0. So 5, 5, 0, 0, 0 is 11 P. To get P, we divide both sides by 11. Here over 11, here over 11. So principal is 5,000 Naira. That is your principal. And that is the answer to this question. Amazing, right? Odenat deposited 800 Naira in the bank at the simple interest rate of 12.5%. Rate is equals 12.5%. After some years, the total amount was one and a half times the principal. Amount. So amount is equals one whole number, one over two times principal. That is three over two principal. For how many years was the money left in the bank? So time is equals question. Deposited 800 Naira. Principal is equals 800 Naira. So the amount is 3 over 2 of the principal. So amount is equals 3 over 2 times 800 Naira. This is 400 Naira times 3. 0, 0. That is 1,200 Naira. So amount is 1,200 Naira. Principal is 800 Naira. Time is question and rate is 12.5%. From our formula, amount is equals principal plus interest. Interest, on the other hand, is principal times rate times time over 100. So, which means amount is given, principal is given, rate is given. You substitute, make time, solve the formula, and solve. So, that should give you 4 years if you solve correctly. Now, look at this last simple interest question. It says, if the interest on 150 Naira for two and a half years is 4.5 Naira. Find the interest on 250 Naira for six months at the same rate. This time around, we did not hear amount. So once you don't hear amount, let your mind calm down and think about simple interest. The interest on 150 Naira for two and a half years is 4.5 percent you have two naira so the smaller one is obviously the interest the bigger amount is obviously the principal principal is equals 150 
Naira. Time is equals two and a half years. Interest is equals 4.5 Naira. Naira. So what do we do? You solve the first part before you look at the second part. You see, there's already a command. If the interest on 150 Naira for two and a half years is 4.5 Naira, find the interest on 250 Naira for six months at the same rate, which means in this one, we are not given rate, but we have principal time and interest. It is from the rates we get in this question, we will use or will take as the rate of the second part. From the first part, principal is interest is principal times rate times time over 100. And rate is equals 100 times interest over principal times time. This is 100 times 4.5 over 150 times 2 times 2, 4 plus 1, 5 times 5 over 2 equals 1.2 percent. So, rate is equals 1.2 percent. From this rate, we'll be able to solve the second part, which says that find the interest. Interest is question on 250 naira. So the capital for the second part is 250 naira, which is the principal for six months at the same rate. So principal times rate 1.2 times time six months. Six months divided by 12, that's one and a half years. So year is one over two. We convert month to years all over 100. Ladies and gentlemen, from the first part, we solved to get rate and the second part says the rate is the same so we are using the rate in the second part of the question to get the interest and the new principal is 250 we use the rate we got time is six months which is half years so when you solve this you should be able to arrive at let me look at what we we'll arrive at 1.5 naira so the interest is 1.5 naira and that's how to answer questions like this so time for assignment open your flashing jam application search simple interest search compound interest solve the questions if you have questions reach me on my social handle thank you